Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got after the closing day of March 3, 2023. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell material sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $82.46. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. Energy Sector ETF was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Let's look at the stocks table of Energy Sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Marathon Petroleum. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $128.37. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. Financial sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of financial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell PayPal holdings. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.9%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $73.91. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. American International G was a previous suggested iron condor option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Citigroup Incorporated was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Morgan Stanley is a weak sell suggestion. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 0.0%. You may expect now a sell return of 3.1%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $98.15 but we expect a possible sell price of $99.88. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Morgan Stanley. If it is over 3.85% of your stock price trade. Wells Fargo was a previous suggested iron condor option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Real Estate Sector ETF belongs to the Trade Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Real Estate Sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Prologis. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $125.37. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. 
Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Pfizer Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $42.3. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Abbuy Incorporated was a previous suggested butterfly option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Industrial Sector ETF was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Let's look at the stocks table of Industrial Sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy 3M company. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 0.3%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $111.88. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.27. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Caterpillar Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 6.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $252.68. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. Boeing Company was a previous suggested butterfly option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Union Pacific was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Material Sector ETF was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Material Sector ETF is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 4.2%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $81.02. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $84.61, unless is overvalued. Material Sector ETF was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Let's look at the stocks table of material sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Sherwin-Williams. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $225.96. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of discretionary sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Netflix Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 0.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $334.03. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Amazon Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $93.13. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. The Home Depot was a previous suggested vertical call option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the Bear Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Staples sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy CVS Health Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.5%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $83.8. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.
On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell ST Lauder. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 1.4%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $251.02. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0. Technology sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Western Digital. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.7%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $39.43. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Advanced Micro Devices was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Advanced Micro Devices is a bear high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 5.9%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $76.73. .73. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $81.77, unless it's overvalued. Advanced Micro Devices was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Texas Instruments was a previous suggested iron condor option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Communication sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of communication sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Utility sector ETF was a previous suggested butterfly option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Let's look at the stocks table of utility sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Dominion Energy. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 0.3%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $56.48. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Bitcoin was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Bitcoin is a trade low class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.8%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $21,933. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $22,510, unless it's overvalued. Let's look at the cryptocurrencies table. There is a weak opportunity to buy NEO. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 48.4%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $12.1. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell EOS. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 6.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $1.22. Binance Coin is a strong buy suggestion. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.2%. You may expect now a buy return of 5.0%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $291.39.
but we expect a possible buy price of $263.63. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Binance Coin if it is below 1.40% of your stock price trade. Cosmos was a previous suggested short cryptocurrency. Today, we suggest to buy it. Ethereum is a mild buy suggestion. It is on a trade low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.6%. You may expect now a buy return of 4.6%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $1,590. But we expect a possible buy price of $1,473. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Ethereum if it is below 0.35% of your stock price trade. Monero is a strong buy suggestion. It is on a bare normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.0%. You may expect now a buy return of 5.0%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $145.96. But we expect a possible buy price of $141.6. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Monero if it is below 1.50% of your stock price trade. Theta token is a strong buy suggestion. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.4%. You may expect now a buy return of 14.6%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $1.11, but we expect a possible buy price of $0.97. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Theta token, if it is below 3.30% of your stock price trade. Tron was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Tron is a trade low class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 0.8%. You may expect now a buy return of 7.4%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $0.0721. But we expect a possible sell price of $0.0756. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $0.0672, unless it's undervalued. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good start on your trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.